Hi, welcome to another episode of Ask Sharon, where I talk about some of the many questions I get uh, when people send me emails and call me up on the telephone. I have a letter here from uh, Jamie. Jamie is asking me to oppose Senate Bill 5899. And 5899 is about payday lending or predatory lending, as some people feel it is. Several years ago, we um, tightened up the laws and did some reforms to protect people, consumers from predatory lending. Um, Senate Bill 5899 uh, was pretty controversial because it would roll back some of those reforms. And what we've done is really working. People can still get loans, uh, but they're not subject to the huge interest rates. So that bill is dead. We also have a letter here from Janet, and Janet is asking me to oppose new fuel taxes. Um, and most of you will be really happy to know that we just passed, uh, just a little while ago, a law related to uh, oil train safety. And part of that bill was a tiny little barrel tax. We've always had barrel taxes on oil that comes by ship but we weren't doing it by rail, and most of our, our crude oil is being shipped that way today. And uh, without the barrel tax, there's not um, money and resources to do prevention planning, um, to mit do mitigation in case of an accident, and to make sure that our first responders in our communities know uh, when a volatile shipment is coming through. Uh, so uh, the barrel tax doesn't affect what you pay at the pump. It's a very tiny tax that we're used to paying. It's now extended to, um, to the oil that's being shipped today. And because of that bill, we're a little bit safer in our communities. And uh, we are not done with the session. Uh, we are going to be going into special session because there's wide differences of opinion on how to pay for schools how to balance our budget, but we're working really hard and we'll be coming in uh, into session for a short period of time next week to try to finish our work and make sure that we um, pay attention to the needs of our future, future leaders who are in our schools today and uh, the people that are in college today and uh, make sure we have infrastructure so that our economy can grow. Thank you so much, and please contact me if you have questions or if you want to speak up about any of the issues we're dealing with.